Hi, I'm Annie of ByAnnie.com and Patterns by Annie. I am so excited to tell you about By Annie's Double Sided Basting Tape. When a pin or wonder clip just doesn't work for holding layers together, we often turn to basting tape. It's quick and easy to apply and provides a secure hold. Unfortunately, it has been difficult to find a consistent supply of quality tape. So we set out to create the best basting tape on the market. Working with a global sourcing agent, we reviewed lots and lots of options and tested roll after roll of tape. We kept working though, and after almost two years of experimentation, we are excited to share our selection with you. By Annie's double-sided basting tape comes from the top adhesive manufacturer in Japan a country known for its excellence in quality control. Together, we've designed the perfect product to meet all of our needs. This extra sticky, narrow basting tape is excellent for sewing and crafting. And as you'll see, it works great with everything from paper and fabric to zippers, mesh, vinyl, soft and stable, and more. Let's talk first about how to use this double-sided basting tape. Begin by applying the sticky side of the tape to the item. Tear or cut the desired length and finger press the tape firmly in place. Peel off the backing paper to expose the second sticky side. Position the item and finger press again to secure it in place. Finally, for a permanent hold, sew the pieces in place. Because of the tape's narrow width and low profile, there is no need to remove it. Of course, if the tape isn't hidden within the seam, you may certainly remove it. Just pull it away and discard it. It has served its purpose. You will find so many ways to use Biani's double-sided basting tape. We use it to precisely position and hold items such as zippers or bindings. There are no pins to pucker the fabric or clips to get in the way, and you don't have to stop to remove those items while stitching. It's also perfect for attaching a zipper to a bound mesh pocket, as we did for this one. If you need to reposition the pieces, just separate, adjust, and press together again. Speaking of mesh, you'll love how easy it is to attach fold-over elastic to mesh pockets using Biani's double-sided basting tape. Just apply the tape to the bottom half of the wrong side of the fold-over elastic. Remove the backing paper and position the mesh along the fold that's woven into the elastic. Then fold the elastic over the mesh, bringing its open edges together. The tape is usually sticky enough to hold the upper side of the elastic in place until you get it stitched. You won't have to worry about the mesh or elastic slipping or moving as you go. Basting tape is especially helpful for holding bulky or solid items that can't be easily pinned, such as handles on large travel bags. A strip or two of basting tape is the perfect solution. Our double-sided basting tape also simplifies attaching trims and appliques. It makes attaching ribbon trim to this wristlet strap extra easy. Unlike pins, basting tape won't leave holes, so it's ideal for items like vinyl, cork, leather, and other items that cannot be pinned. We used basting tape to hold this magnet in position until we can get it sewn in place. Basting tape also works well to hold this clear vinyl pocket. I've applied it close to the edge where it will be covered by another layer. Note that the tape is sticky enough to enable you to reposition the pocket if needed. Basting tape is also the perfect choice to hold the layers of cork together for this folded strap. You may also use basting tape with soft and stable. It works well when layering pieces for quilting. A quick X of tape from corner to corner holds the fabric in place and eliminates the need for pins or spray. And if you need to readjust the layers as you go, that's easy too. Just lift the fabric, smooth the layers, and you're ready to go again. Basting tape sticks to paper as well as fabric. So if you're making a paper pieced block and you want to hold your first piece of fabric in place, a small piece works great. If you enjoy making cards, 
basting tape is perfect for attaching photos or embellishments like paper, ribbon, or lace. Basting tape also helps to prevent feeding problems. The tape will keep the layers firmly together and help prevent the frustration of one side being shorter than the other even though they were cut to the same length. In this case, I'm going to sew a French seam so I can leave the tape in place. If you want to press the seam open, just remove the tape before you press. If you're a garment maker, you'll love basting tape for lots of uses, holding a pocket in place, securing a hem, and more. Buy Annie's double-sided basting tape is 3 millimeters wide, or about an eighth of an inch, and packaged on a roll, making it very manageable and easy to use. In each package, you will get two 10-meter rolls for a total of 20 meters or about 21.8 yards. Since you'll usually use just a few inches for each item, you'll have plenty of tape for a variety of projects. I know that you'll enjoy using Biani's double-sided basting tape in all of your sewing and crafting projects and that you'll appreciate how very easy it is to use. Ask for it at your local quilt shop or find it at byannie.com. We cannot wait to see what you make, so be sure to share pictures of your finished projects with us. Find us on Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, and YouTube by using at Patterns by Annie. And don't forget to tag us in your posts. Be sure to enter our monthly photo contest, too. Thank you so much for watching. Happy stitching!